Jim Marino, Matt Topolsky, alongside Brad Gilmore for another action-packed edition of the reality of wrestling. And we got to remind everyone, if you missed the last stand, you still can check it out. Go to realityofwrestling.com for details on how to order the replay. Brad, right here tonight, the return of Jacob Fatu. Take it away. Jacob Fatu, the Super Samoan, the ultimate boost, the Samoan Samurai, perhaps the greatest athlete I've seen in reality of wrestling. Abe Jackson, what a hell of a first client to sign. This man is undefeated, and he's been nothing but impressive. But we're going to get the action started this week on the row as Chad Skywalker and Axton Lowe are back at it once again. just a little bit here, but make no mistake, Chad Skywalker, whether you like him or not, people have a lot of things to say about this man, but one thing you cannot deny is he is very talented when he gets inside of the square And his opponent from Bristol, Tennessee, weighing in at 200 pounds, Axton Lowe! What a physical exhibition in professional wrestling this is going to be. You look at your short list, of some of the up and coming talents in all of professional wrestling. Chad Skywalker and of course Axton Lowe need to be on that list. This will be some encounter. And this is the second time we've seen these two men inside the squared circle here at Reality Wrestling. The first time was of course Skywalker's debut and they took each other to the limit. I wonder what's going to occur here tonight. Could this be the second and what we're going to see a series of matches between these two. You never know, Matt Topolsky. This matchup is underway. The game's been shipped here early on. Frog over the top from Axton Lowe. These two loved implementing high offense, high flying offense. Lucha Libre style sometimes, Matt Topolsky. Oh, and Axton Lowe trying to slap the style out of Skywalker. And now Skywalker just throws him out to the outside right here in front of us. And wait a minute. Chad Skywalker over the top, but he lands on his feet. Skywalker inside out, back into an arm drag. Axton low drop kick. Wow, look at that. Skywalker rocketing into the sky. Axton low trading Chad Skywalker like a human pinball right now. In the corner here. Axton low talking a little bit of trash here as well. Roll up. Oh! Wow, cover him right now. That's how it got to be all Matt Topolsky. One, One two. two. Oh, my goodness. I thought Axton Lowe had experienced lights out right there. What a shot to the temple from Chad Skywalker. I thought Skywalker just kicked him into the next lifetime with Pin that Pin attempt one. here again. Hooks both legs. Kick out a two. Are we sure Axton Lowe's not a force ghost right now? chest of Skywalker with those saber-like chops. Oh, and turns him inside out. A return there from Chad Skywalker. What a clothesline. Drops that fist across the face. Cover here. Pin attempt once again. Kick out at two. I get the sense that these two don't really like each other very much, Brad. And I don't know if perhaps it's because they remind themselves of each other. I'm, I'm not sure. There's there's a little bit of a looking into a mirror type thing. Oh, these, these, these men. Skywalker likes anybody but himself. 
to be quite honest with you, he comes out, he's taking selfies on the way to the ring. He's very vain, he's conceited, he's cocky, he's arrogant, but he really has a lot of reasons to be. The man is very good at what he does. Oh, wow, look at that. Samoa drop, rolls through, stomps on the chest, springboard, second rope, into a moonsault. Reversal here, reversal cover. Oh, wow. Well, talk about getting up close and personal right in the middle of that kick out. Wow. I think they're both trying to catch their breath. It's been zero to 100 real quick. That's a hell of a way to make a living trying to catch your breath while catching a forearm in the mouth at the same time. Well, I'm glad on the, I'm on this side of the ring, Matt Topolsky, and not inside it. Oh, he's gonna go for a German. And now Axel Lowe's gonna do it. Reversal. Oh. Oh. Axton Lowe catches Chad Skywalker in the back of the head. Is that the knockout shot that Axton Lowe was looking for? Cover here. One, two. Can barely make the cover, and it's not enough. The match continues. Our referee Kelly was right there. Axe, uh, excuse me, Skywalker was able to get a shoulder up, and now Axel Lowe trying to feed off the energy of the Road Nation. And look at Skywalker. Skywalker grabbing on the ankle and foot of Axton Lowe to try to stop any momentum he was getting. Oh! Maybe Skywalker was just playing a little bit of possum there, another stomp to the sternum. Rolling Santon over the top. Axton Lowe's gone on the outside. Chad Skywalker looking to join him here. Oh my goodness. Flash landing on the outside of the ring. Back and forth, a seesaw trial here between Skywalker and Axton Lowe. Now up top, Chad Skywalker. Is it a moonsault he's looking for? No! Was looking for that Phoenix splash. But he lands on his feet somehow, some way. Now Axton Lowe on the second rope. On the top rope. Rolling sunset flip. Oh my lord, man. I'm having a hard time keeping up. Close line and both men are down. Axton Lowe stays on top. Looking for the pin here again, my goodness. Not a moment for these athletes or your commentating team to take a breath. I <laughs> know Matt Topolsky. I'm gonna have to call a timeout after this one. High intensity, high impact, high action. Oh! Reversal there from Chad Skywalker. Axton Lowe looking for a suplex. He turns it into a stunner. Off the ropes. Reversal here. Wait a minute, though. Axton Lowe looking for that reality check. Roll up here. Roll up here. Crucifix. Reversal here from Axton Lowe. Reversal from Skywalker. Look at the power of Axton Lowe. Skywalker in that fireman's carry. Reversal yet again. Sends him into the buckle. Up top. Looking for that slice spread. Misses it, and now here we are. Is he going to hit it? This third attempt. Oh, wait a minute. Another reversal. Oh, screw. He's got the tights. He's got the tights. He's got the win. Here is your winner, Chad Skywalker. What a physical exhibition between these two, but when it's all said and done, Chad Skywalker gets the W, but under controversial circumstances. And you know that Axton Lowe is damn well going to demand a rematch after this one. By any means necessary, Chad Skywalker continues to win and win and win at the Row. Row Nation, I'm Ashley Bull. Backstage here with all day, Will Lockhart. 
Now, Will, congratulations on the impressive performance at the last stand and winning the five-way match at Row on the Rise to become the new number one contender for the Texas Championship. Ashley, I'm excited. I'm excited because I'm done with Legion. It's about damn time. I'm excited because I'm the number one contender for the Texas title. It's about damn time. I do want to address something. This past year's it's been a little hectic for me. It's been a little fuzzy. It's been a nightmare. But I woke up. And I'm not going to let that past nightmare dictate my future dreams. My dream right now is taking the Texas title from Ryan Davidson, the bear. <laughs> the odds have been stacked against me from the beginning, Ashley. <laughs> but since when a dream's based on chance, dreams are based on passion and what's in your heart. And what's in my heart right now is that it's bear hunting season. Ryan Davidson, you, just like everybody else out there, is going to know why they call me all damn day. Thanks, Ashley. Thanks, Will. Hmm. Hashtag things that make you go, hmm. Kendrick, big boy, I am hurting real bad. From that No Limits ladder match. I mean, I could barely even walk. You are a big boy? I'm serious. <laughs> I could barely even walk right now. You're walking around like an old man. I feel like an old man. You good? Ah! Ah! The table. The table. The table. The No, no Limits no. ladder match still? Yes. You're not feeling anything? Yeah, I mean, a little bit. My neck's a little sore, but... No yeah. kinks? Yeah, but did you see the gifts, though? I did. Boy, at Flippy Pro, when you did the coast to coast, and you kicked the ladder through Fly Draft's head? you got to give me one for that. Nice. nice. What about La Familia? You took them and you speared them right through the table. A double spear. I've never even seen that. You know what? I'm going to have to give you one for that one. Nice. <laughs> but, all right, I mean. Where do we go from here, though? Like, we face fly death. I understand it wasn't just us against them. It was like a fatal four-way and this time no limits ladder match. What do we do now? How do we prove the cool? How do we get back? Back to where we start. Number one contenders. First off, new headbands. Second, I mean, I don't know where yours is, but second, we're going to earn our way back to the top. There's no question about it. I mean, you're former TV champion. We're former tag team champions. Yeah. We're the cool. Yeah. And this, you know, we haven't had a one-on-one -on -one opportunity with Fly Def, but when we get our chance and we become the number one contenders, yeah. we're going to become the new champions. But first, you're right. tonight, what? Reno's. Reno's? Reno, are you down? Can drink some salus? Are you down? Of course I'm down. Come on, help me up though. I mean, I'm seriously hurting. Like, oh, darn me too. I'm gonna go knock down some four. An accident in the 21st century presents an entirely new set of challenges. From self-driving cars to failures in new safety technology, if you've been injured in a car accident, you need a 21st century lawyer. After all. You have to make your case here before you can win it here. Injured? Choose the smart lawyer. Call Walker, Texas Lawyer now and download the Walker, Texas Lawyer app. Introducing first from Virginia Beach, Virginia, weighing in at 230 pounds, J.J. Blake. Well, since she can never do it right, from Virginia Beach, Virginia, he weighs in the night at 230 pounds. He is the former, current, and future champion of all television, the Dynamite Adonis, J.J. Blake. New Year, same garbage from you. Matt Topolsky, you know what? You're just a hater. You're a hater because you are not dying. No. against his opponent. The man who single-handedly took out Legion. It's Clay Roberts. Making his way to the ring from Skipperville, Alabama, weighing in at 175 pounds, Clay Roberts. Clay Roberts looks like he was just shot out of a cannon. He's just happy to be away from Skipperville. Oh, give me a break. 
This is a this is a man that took Legion to the very depths of hell, and for a short period of time, thought he had finished them off. That's a bad night when you take somebody to hell and you still wake up at Skipperville. He's not from Virginia Beach, Virginia. He's not an Adonis. Look at the size difference here. JJ Boy. Oh, it's like Cradle. Oh, it's like Cradle. Oh, too. JJ. oh my goodness. It was almost over there in the first few seconds. I would have loved to hear the intellectual gymnastics from you to explain that loss. Wait, well, there we go. Size and strength from J.J. Blake. Wait a minute, oh, another, another roll up here, another roll up. Clay Roberts, very impressive. Kick out at one and a half, and once again, he is reminding J.J. Blake. Oh. He had a lock from behind. Look at this, looking for another inside crate uh -oh. here. But he doesn't have the power. He's not Adonis, like I said. J.J. Blake. Oh. Oh. Clay Roberts in the opening moments of this matchup here just staying one step ahead of J.J. Blake. And then cuts him off right there with that knee to the midsection. How many championships have Clay Roberts won? How many? How many? Oh, I'll wait. I can wait all night. Zero. Oh, so zero. We, so, so we have an even contest. We have two athletes, both looking to get into the title picture. No. Neither one of them holding a title currently. This is professional oh, wrestling. Wow. And what have you done for me lately, Brad Gilmore? Cover here. One, two, and a kick out. J.J. Blake is a former television champion. Now, he is still currently the champion of all television. Let's get that distinction out there very clearly, Matt Topolsky. Clay Roberts has not won a single title. Zero. It's the same number as the graduating class in Skipperville. Oh! A knife edge chop right there. Irish whip into the corner. Clay Roberts, head of steam. There's that power you were talking about. Snake eyes in the corner. Very impressive. Yeah. Oh, kick. There you are. Right to the jaw. That's got to be all. That was a dynamite bicycle kick. As J.J. Blake. Oh, wait a minute. Are we going to see it? Here it is. He's going to put his black hammer in the face of Clay Roberts. Clay with a reversal. Clay Roberts looking for that hip toss. Scoop. Oh. Into a slam. Boom. J.J. Blake. One, two. Blake with a different level of intensity here tonight. Certainly there has to be a sense of urgency within him to start getting some wins and get back into the conversation. Clay Roberts, on the other hand, not going to let anyone steal his thunder. 2019 could be a very special year in his career. Oh, look at this. Tilt to one side slam. Very impressive. Power. That is power. And wait a minute. Blake going up to the second rope. Oh, wow. Forearm across the face. This has got to be it. Clay Roberts kicks out again. Even you, Matt Topolsky, you have to admit Clay Roberts is in a bad way right now. Trying to get Clay Roberts back into it. Clay Roberts back to a vertical base map, but still taking a lot of damage here. Oh, oh whoa. A shot right there from Clay oh. Roberts. Shot to the jaw. Look at the power. Oh, into a Death Valley driver. Cover one, two. Oh, no. Somehow kicked out. J.J. Blake. 
one impressive display of power after another here tonight. Even I cannot deny that. Blake, wait for it. Here it comes. Blake in. Blake in. Oh, wait a minute. Excellent reversal there from Clay Roberts. Elbow to the face. What is he going to the gun. Oh, that lifting knee. Ducks underneath. Oh. Swinging neck breaker from Clay Roberts. And now Clay Roberts springs up. Does he have any gas left in the tank to finish off J.J. Blake? He's tuning up for something, trying to get that running knee. Oh, and then Blake oh. ran right into a blanket. Cover one, two, three. Here is your winner, J.J. Blake. The Dynamite Adonis picks up a big W in 2019. And J.J. Blake, well on his way back to championship contention here at the Reality of Wrestling. Adonis looks like Matt Tepolsky. Congratulations on the victory. What does this mean for the Dynamite Adonis, J.J. Blake? What this means, what this means for the champion of all television, Asia, Japan, Korea, Australia, California, everywhere. It means I'm back. I'm winning these things. I'm on the streak. I'm going straight to the top. And nobody can stop me. So what's next? I think what's next is a championship of the road. Well, you heard it right there, Matt Topolsky, the champion of all television, looking to be the champion of all reality of wrestling. Well, I like the part where he said he would go to Asia. I'll pay for his flight. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Ashley Bull, backstage here with the television champion, Aiden Cristiano. Now, Aiden, it's been several months since we've seen you here at The Row, since your series of matches with the Mysterious Q. Why did you choose to come back now? He never went anywhere. The family has always been here. <laughs> Ashley, look, it's, it's very simple. When you go through the type of punishment that I did in that series with the Mysterious Q, especially that last match, well, you leave a part of yourself in those type of matches. I didn't go anywhere because I chose to. I was forced to take time off to recover. But you know what? I adapt. That's what I do. That's what La Familia does, and we're the best at it. That's why right now, Ashley, you are looking at the brand new television champion. Do you have any idea what that means? Of course not. Of course not. No, of course, of course. Let me tell you what it means. This symbolizes power, Ashley. Power is the most coveted commodity on this planet. And La Familia, once again, has it. We toppled the giant, and now anything we want will be ours. For over 13 years, the king of solar screens has been an industry leader, and we proudly use 100% American-made products. Home of the $55 any size, any color solar screen. Well, what about arches? $55. What about circle? $55. What about rectangles? $55, $55, $55. Any size, any color, install free. The king of solar screens, on time, every time. Now can you dig that, sucker? Welcome back to The Row, Brad Gilmore and Matt Topolsky. And up next, Jacob fought two. Take it away. 2019. 2019 is the year of the faith of reality of wrestling, Abel Andrew Jackson. So stand up, stand up, you filthy bums. Stand up for greatness. 
Because in 2019, it's time to make Abel great again. And I'm going straight to the top on the campaign trail. And it's being led by my enforcer. The Samoan Werewolf, Jacob Fox. I told you, I told you it was coming, that 2019 would be the year, 2019 would be the year that I'm going straight to the top. So stand up for greatness, you filthy bum, stand up. It's not time to sit down. You stand up. Stand up for greatness. From the Great Lakes, weighing in at 200 and a quarter pounds, Scott Smith. Well, here comes Scott Smith from the Great Lakes, Brad Gilmore. Here he is. But uh, I, I think he might want to get a one-way ticket back to the Great Lakes now before he steps inside the... I was about to say the octagon. It's essentially what it is when Jacob Fatu is in there. But before he steps inside the squared circle, Jacob Fatu. Well, have you ever seen the movie Gladiator before where they, they feed the prisoners to lions? I'm familiar. Yes, this uh, uh, it has that familiar feeling. Oh, wait a minute. Well, Scott Smith here trying to do something that uh, I don't think anyone would think would be possible. Oh, no. oh God, no. Oh! Spinning fall away slam. For the ultimate ooze. Jacob Fatu. Oh! The Samoan Samurai. A super kick right to the bridge of the nose. And Scott Smith may need some reconstructive surgery when this one's over. Oh, Matt Topolsky. Oh! Just, oh, it's over. Wow. What on him? What a moonsault. Have you ever seen an athlete like this before? Absolutely not. Abe Jackson has found himself quite the client. Fatu going full Thanos. And with a snap of his fingers, he might disintegrate Scott Smith. Scott Smith doing whatever he can to fight here. Oh, wait. Scott Smith, though. Now, if I were Scott Smith, I would hightail it out of that ring and go get a bartending job. This is a tough way to make a living, let me tell you. Off the ropes here. Wait a minute. He's getting some momentum. Oh. Some 